then what, what does define the essence of what it means to be human? And, and I would submit to you is that we don't really know yet. And what if it turns mm -hmm. out that at some point we find uh, uh, an ancestor that, uh, uh, that is really the, 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 the link between us and our past? Uh, is it possible mm -hmm. that, that the definition of human, being a human being is constantly evolving? Um, mm -hmm. I would submit to you that that, that may very well be the case and that uh, being human isn't necessarily being this. Being human is, is something uh, far more profound, uh, far more uh, existential, something that is, is uh, beyond our, our current comprehension and reasoning. Um, I think if it turns out that we are not alone in the universe, maybe there's a lot of things like us that we can learn from. Imagine, imagine learning a million years worth of human evolution and lessons within months. Imagine if, if there was an advanced uh, uh, civilization, an entity that came down and all of a sudden now we realize that our, our current understanding of the universe uh, is, is certainly not comprehensive. And maybe we can learn a lot and maybe we can learn to be better than, than, than the human beings we are now to, to, to achieve where we should be. Instead of a lot of us fighting and, and looking at the, the 10% differences that we have as, as a species, maybe we learn to focus on the 90% that we have in common instead. And maybe we learn that national boundaries uh, and socioeconomic boundaries um, aren't, aren't necessary. Uh, because if you look at a map and you take away all the lines and the national boundaries, you realize very quickly we're all connected. We're all, we're all, we're all living on the same little rock together. Yeah. Uh, is it possible that we can learn to be more than human uh, from, from something else? Um, I, I, think it's, I think it's possible, certainly.